Hello everybody. Here at the Eli M. Obler Library, we have a great selection of materials and our special collections and archives. Today, let's take a look at how to access our growing online collections and how to make your search more efficient. Starting at the ISU Library homepage, click on Libraries and Collections. Then, select Special Collections. From there, we scroll down until we see Online Collections. As you see, here are all of our online collections. I now want to show you a very neat trick to save you hours of research. If you click this plus sign, it'll allow you to do an advanced search. Let's say that my research topic is tourism in Yellowstone National Park. In the search bar, I'm going to write Yellowstone National Park. Also, I can select how I want my search terms to be grouped. I'm going to select the exact phrase since there are many places in Idaho that use the name Yellowstone when referring to a place. This drop down menu allows us to use the search term in a specific field. For my Yellowstone National Park search term, I'm going to select the subject field. As you can see, these are all the results from all the online collections, and I get a lot of results. If I want to narrow my search down a little more, I can add another field in the advanced search. For example, I'm going to use the search term tourism. Now we've narrowed it down to only 11 records. This is one of the ways you can use advanced search to save time on your research. Another search technique is browsing under the subject headings. Using our last example, here we have a camping subject heading and we have a snowmobiling subject heading, which both relate to our research topic of tourism in Yellowstone National Park. A quick browse through the subject headings will allow you to find related terms that would be missing if you searched for tourism in advanced search. It also saves you time from thinking of all the search terms related to tourism. Lastly, since the majority of our holdings are physical and not available for viewing online, we can use the advanced search to narrow down which physical collections relate to our topic. From there, we can browse the collection guides to see if there's any material relating to our topic. If you're wanting to look at physical materials, please reach out to the special collections and archives to set up an appointment. Hopefully, these tips can help you enjoy our fascinating online collections.